Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are finally taking a look at Babylon's Fall first trailer. Uh, apparently it's a Square Enix game, <clears throat> also developed by Platinum Games. So we kind of have the same case of Nier Automata uh, right here. Now, I think I've said this before, but it seems like I have an issue with Square Enix, right? Uh, I've seen the teaser of this game back in... E3 2019 I thought it looked pretty cool I thought the teaser looked pretty cool and I was kind of curious to see what this game was about but I was really scared because it was it was Square Enix and <clears throat> the issue is that I don't I don't hate Square Enix right I don't hate them like I don't know what it is but ever since I was a kid it has always been the case it has, it has always been like that I haven't been influenced by anything at all I just don't care about their games. It's just the way it is. So it was the same thing with Nier Automata. I saw it. I thought it looked pretty cool. Uh, when it wasn't out yet. And when it came out. I was like. Well. I don't really care about it. I don't know why it's like that. And it's the same thing again with uh, Final Fantasy 7. I need an RPG in my life. I need like a really, really RPG-ish uh, game. And <laughs> I just can't find one because it seems like Square Enix uh, is the one making all the RPG games, you know. But whatever. Um, so Babylon's Fall, I'm scared that it does the same effect as all the other games. I'm scared I have the same thing going on when I was already six years old, you know. But I thought I think the game looks pretty cool. And from what I see here uh, with the picture uh, right here on the screen... It seems interesting. I want to see what it is about and uh, hopefully it would be good. This was during the state of play, but I was asleep apparently. It's 4 p.m. right now. I'm I'm getting noc nocturnal. I, I don't like it very much, but uh, whatever. <laughs> All right, let's see the trailer. Oh, man, I'm so scared. Wow, okay. Music's pretty cool. Very near automatic ish uh, gameplay. Yes. Ooh, the music. Wow. Ooh, Devil May Cry. Oh, this was the thing that was in the the teaser. Oh wow, you can clash with a bus like that. Sick. Whoa, whoa, what's that? Oh man, not tell me that's it. Oh, God damn it, that's it. All right, pretty cool. Game it looks pretty badass. Let me see that again. The music is really good. Liking it. Oh. So they have these um Oh, you can, you can take the sword from the bus. Okay, 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 okay. Do you see that? They all have these uh, things on their back. And it seems like you can, like they, they, they summon some sort of, like, how do you call them? Ropes? 
strands. <laughs> uh, you have those little things that come out that come out of your of your pack, and you can like grab things with with that. Uh, I think he, he does a combo in mid air with that. Kind of pulls him, kind of like the Devil Bringer from Nero. Very Devil May Cry. Very. Um, this is Kamiya, right? See, he does that thing. So they summon those things to uh, kind of help them in the fight. And you can grab the sword from the boss with that. Sorry about that. That's pretty badass. Look at this. Sick. Alright, I like this game. <laughs> I like what I see, right? But when the game comes out, I'm going to be like, oh, whatever. It, it sucks. I don't want to be like that. I, I'm, I'm interested in that game. Looks pretty interesting. It seems like they have four characters, so you can hopefully you can play with different characters. This is a single player game, by the way, I believe. I mean, if it's platinum game, it's most likely going to be a single player. I'm interested. I'm very interested. That's all I can say for now. And it's probably one of the only uh, games in 2020 that's coming out uh, that seems to be kind of interesting to me. I don't know. When they say it's coming out, summer 2020, isn't that like, uh, summer 2020, huh? Isn't that the same time around, uh, PS5 release? <laughs> mm. <clears> hmm. <throat> that's, that's, uh, that's questionable. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it is. <clears throat> isn't the PS5 like, how do you call it? Retro compatible or something? <clears throat> I believe it is. Sorry, I'm kind of sick. My throat is kind of fucked. I just woke up and I, I'm sick. That's good. Okay. Um, but yeah. Seems pretty cool. I think uh, the game seems pretty cool. Seems pretty badass. I like I like the trailer. I like what I saw. I, I like what I just saw. Uh, and uh, hopefully, this feeling will stay and will stick around when the game comes out. Because I don't know what it is, man. Square Enix, as soon as their name is on something, I, I, I'm getting a bit scared. I don't know why. I, I'm not even getting scared. I don't care. It's just that it will happen. It will just happen. And I know it. But I hope not for this game. Anyways. Yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Subscribe to my channel. Leave a like. I need just one more subscriber to hit 200 subs. Anyways, I'm out. See ya.